Hi, this is Phoenix Genesis for PhoenixGenesis.com and our two YouTube channels, Phoenix Genesis and Fry Camp. And today is the day for PS4 owners. It's Call of Duty Advanced Warfare Exo Zombies um, Outbreak. This is from the Havoc DLC um, pack, and this is uh, John Malkovich. He's playing Oz the janitor. In my opinion, he is the absolute best character to play. He's got the best lines. Unfortunately, they're random. You can't pick and choose which of the four characters, but let's check him out. So first thing we did was turn the power on, then we grabbed the bulldog shotgun. We're in this little area. We have an open day doors. Um, it's not worth wasting ammo for the first round. Just kind of whack them with your um, knife. Nice melee attack. Guess he didn't need it. <laughs> Told you he's right. hilarious. Lab rats live to run the maze again. Yes, the lab rats of Atlas Corporation. So we are in Atlas. Um, we had a secret level Sector 6 that uh, they brought back two zombies. If you had played uh, Exo Survival and finished it in Riot, they took some of those zombies, put it in that sector. And of course, you know, what happens with the zombie virus? It, it spreads and mutates. And this is our Exo Medic. He's going to play me some doctor, which is basically your revive. If you've ever played any uh, Call of Duty, Treyarch's Call of Duty zombies, um, they really kind of did a homage, um, you know, borrowing heavily. Of course, yes, that, uh, buying that medic came in handy because I was an idiot not paying attention and I died right away and revived. I think you get two revives, um, not quite, yeah, I think you do get two revives and that's it, just like the regular zombies. And yes, you have to acquire an exosuit. I do not have that yet, and it looks like the zombies don't either at this point. So it's our second revive. As usual, the bulldog is a nice opening um, weapon. Now we get hyper damage, which is basically a uh, one hit, one kill. He tell I mean, pretty much if you listen to the call outs that John's giving you. Um, John slash Oz is the name of the character. You're going to know what's going on. He'll tell you when you're reloading. He tells you basically what's going on when there's a supply drop. He'll let you know. So you just kind of follow his lead. Again, power is very easy to find and turn on, which I'm really appreciative of compared to older Call of Duty uh, zombie games. And the zombies aren't that powerful at the beginning, which is pretty cool. Now we've got orange glowy eyes. I wonder if at some point um, the eyes will start changing colors. They mutate and get more powerful or if they're in exo mode or I don't know. It'll be cool to see. Right now they're just this kind of orange uh, fiery kind of look. An orbital drop is how Atlas sends supplies. So hello. He's telling you right now there's an orbital drop obviously outside because they're not going to drop it inside. Yes, full ammo. Don't forget to get your full reload. So that saves you 250 credits. And these stairs are great because you can do the kind of the classic um, rape train as, as the term we've heard before where you can kind of line all your ducks up in a row and take these baddies out. There we go. There's our supply drop. Yes, camouflage. Drop. That shit came from space. <laughs> I love him. He's so funny. That shit came from space. Yeah, he's, he's classic. My only disappointment is we only get one map. We're going to have to wait, like, what, three months for map number two of uh, Exo Zombies. I mean... I really want to play more maps of Exo Zombies because, uh, yeah, I think they did a really nice job and I'll be kind of excited to see what they do. Overall, I think the Havoc, Havoc DLC, the, the first DLC is very, very nice. That's my first impressions. I played through once of each of the maps and I played a couple of, of the Exo Zombies so far, a couple rounds. Of course, uh, PS4, we just got it today, so I really haven't, like, watched too much. I wanted to be more of a surprise and not watch the Xbox version and, you know, like, just to kind of figure it all out myself. And 
you gotta watch out for these narrow quarters. It's easy to, um, yeah, get kind of uh, over uh, swarmed, overwhelmed by these guys. Like, like right about now. <laughs> the question is, who's, hel who's helping him out? Okay, that was my second revive. That's it. Well, I haven't bought a third. I don't know if I did buy a third. Would I get three? I mean, is there infinite revives? That'd be kind of cool. And that was something I could have activated, but I went by it so fast I just didn't. Um, decontamination zone. Oh, yeah. Um, decontamination zone, to the best of my memory, is when you um, get uh, infected and you... Um, have about a minute to get to the decontamination. There's a countdown to get to the decontamination zone, otherwise you're a zombie. I think game's over, and since it's a single-player multiplayer, you would go into spectator mode, and you get to watch your teammates as you get to, like, chew on them. Anyway, I hope you liked uh, that. I've also, go to Frag Camp. I'm going to be putting more um, Exo Zombie gameplay, but I wanted to put... Uh, at least one up here on my main Phoenix Genesis channel. Again, this is Phoenix Genesis signing out. Thanks for watching.